weapons could also do it. The the hammer though, the hammer not so much. I don't think the hammer could. I think we would die pretty quick with the hammer, as seen in previous uh, instances when we we couldn't even beat hard with the hammer, let alone trying to be expert with the hammer. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. All right, let's see. Um, yeah, I'll go you. Go you. I forgot we had bounces. Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It's Lodis here back with another Nordic Ashes run. We're going to jump right on into this as we talked in the last episode how we were going to go about doing this. So we'll we'll see we'll see what we can get going on here. Um, I do believe I said I was going to do another Axel Thor run, so we'll do that and try it out. Um, Let's see. To earn my trust, you'll have to buy at least 25 of my items. We still haven't discovered any of that. Gained two complete green hearts in a run. I haven't found any of those. Hansi will probably be our next unlock. Um... But, of course, we still have <laughs> tons of islands to unlock. Um, but yeah, we're going to run Stormbringer. Hopefully we can defeat Midgard on Expert Mode. We'll get 120% uh, more uh, meta progression. So yeah, we'll see how this goes, and hopefully we can make some pretty good progress here. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Um, also, if you guys do end up enjoying this, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. I'd really appreciate it. It uh, helps me out a lot. Um, reduce the dash cooldown by 35%. Yeah, sure. That's not bad. Um, let's see. Hopefully, hopefully we can make some pretty good progress here. It is going to be a little, probably bit of a slower kind of start, but we'll see. Um, damage in area, sure. Cooldown in area, sure. Damage in projectiles, yes. Um, projectiles I'll take in duration, sure. Okay. Elga could, could probably be pretty good. I mean, well, we, we need to get the win out with Axel Dora at some point, so we'll, we'll just, we'll try and do that. Um, Stormbringer, though, we had a crazy run with Stormbringer. If you guys uh, haven't checked out that video, make sure you guys go check it out. Um, it was, it was pretty crazy. Like, we killed the boss, like, we shredded the boss, actually. We didn't just kill him, we, we shredded him. We beat him in a <laughs> very, very quick time, so... I'll take this since it's the biggest uh, decrease for cooldown right now. It's not too bad there. Um, I'm probably going to take the damage one as well. Let's make our way down to, um, other than running in constant circles, try and make our way down towards some of the, um, some of the altars or uh, monoliths. Let's see what we got going on here. Go to the points one, I guess, first. See how many points it'll take. Ooh, we got the stick. Okay. What is the stick again? I don't remember. Plus one damage, plus ten attack speed. Yeah, I'll take that. <clears throat> For three points. I'll take that. That's not bad. Um, we're already getting low on damage, which is no bueno. We got five here. What is this one? Move speed plus twenty? Yeah, I'll take that. I will take that. We'll dash up and around. Um, let's get projectiles duration, projectiles in area. Um, let's reroll. Projectiles duration, sure. I want projectiles in cooldown. Yeah, that one could be pretty good. Uh, we'll throw a point into this, and then a point into this as well. Okay. We should be sitting in a pretty good spot. Cooldown, we definitely need more cooldown. Definitely need more cooldown. Oops. I thought we were going to be a goner there. Okay. More projectiles for sure. Could be uh, pretty useful here. Um, I need to make my way down towards the ascension. Oh, crap. I guess we could technically just go up as well. Grab this. Let's see. Um, yes. Damage in area. I'd rather get damage and projectiles if possible. Uh, this is just plus one damage, so nothing too crazy. Okay. Like, we are one-shotting everything, which is very good. I do apologize that this is very, very loud. Okay, we got that super quick. Collect the stone and the stick in the same run. 
Alright. <clears throat> this looks like we unlocked a slingshot. Let's come up here and grab this. Hopefully this will hopefully change some stuff up. We're gonna go for the double one. Uh, cast three lightning each second. The deal. Okay, throw axe is the same. Ignoring gravity. I think I'm gonna go with that one. Ooh, okay. I don't know how I feel about this. As it definitely wipes everything out around us, but it doesn't have the uh, the good feeling like before of killing stuff. Let's try and pick ball this. All that XP, man. That's a, that was a lot of XP there, so definitely want to try and grab all that. Let's grab this, make our way over to the mine. And then we should have... It looks like we collected everything other than the, the altars, of course, which we can run up and just collect more. They're not the greatest altars. Uh, crit and move speed, so nothing too, too crazy. Um, let's see here. I do want projectiles, but I also really, really want... Dan uh, sure, I'll take that one. This one, I definitely want projectiles and damage. So I'm gonna re-roll like crazy on this one. Um, ooh, I think we, we need damage though. Like we need the damage. Since we haven't gotten a damage upgrade in a hot minute. And with, um, unfortunately with this, oh, spend 999 gold. Okay, cool. I, I didn't spend any gold, but okay, sweet. I mean, this has some pretty good wave clear, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. If we can make it to where we can get the other upgrade, the lightning would probably help a good bit as well. Okay, it doesn't feel too bad right now. I mean, we're making it. I think it'd be crazy to get like two, 200 um, aggression. Since the last expert run we did, we ran, um, we are already up to like, we got to like 187 like super quick. I do gotta remember though, like, um, we could lose very quickly, HP wise, so we gotta keep an eye on that. Um, let's do this. Damage of projectiles, that easy, man. That easy. Alright. Run around, try and get that last point. Okay. Looking good so far. Looks like we got the uh, elites coming up. Ooh, almost got hit there by that uh, by that crow. Oh, we got hit there. We got one heart left. We can't we can't take a hit. We cannot take a hit. Um, I'll get you. I'll get you. Okay. Oh, perfect. We can take, like, one hit. Okay. I'd rather not take any hits, but we, we are granted one hit right now. I would love to try and get either a little bit more gold. I would love to get more, um, more health pots to drop, if possible. That'd be very nice. Very, very nice. Um... I think after this run, when we go to the new area, we'll try out um, maybe a full build on the uh, the lightning shoulder pads or whatever they're called. Oh, we got the... Ooh, I forgot about this. Boom. Heals one heart. I, I don't remember how frequent that is. I did forget that we got that, though, in the last episode. Okay, we should be able to beat this. It's probably going to be a little slow, not as quick as um, the other fights that we've done. So, um, definitely want to up cooldown. Ooh, I want to get this, this, this. Um, let's, uh, I can't max you out. Let's do, yeah, damage cooldown, area effect prod, sure. Okay. We can get this next upgrade for the next ascension for the axe. I think that'll be pretty crazy because it'll shoot the lightning out as well. I mean, we're about to wipe them out here. Yeah, dude, too easy. Too easy, dude. Okay. All right, ooh, magnet's huge. Um, 
That's one full red heart container. Definitely need that. Throw spectral skulls that deal damage and can freeze enemies. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll take that. Um, restores a red heart. Yep, I'll take that as well. And let's get uh, the magnet. That will be huge. Oh, we should better not leave that crystal either. That'd be a, that'd be a tough one, so. Um, oh, now you get me the... Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, this seems pretty cool. This would be insane, probably, to upgrade. Enemies that die have a 10% chance of creating another skull. Oh, okay. But we're going Axe Storm, baby. We are going Axe Storm. I'm going to upgrade you. Cooldown and damage. Effect prob, sure. Cooldown, sure. Um, I do want damage. All right, sweet. Should be pretty good. Okay. Cooldown is game to a good point. Oh, I do like this already. It grants 50% cooldown. If you take damage, it will break. Okay. Oh, I don't have the points for that. I'll take that. I mean, it kind of negates the build that we're going because, like, we need to get hit. So maybe I'll wait to pick that up. I mean, we do have something on the ground that we can take a hit. Um, let's take another hit. Maybe if we can get hit. <laughs> okay, effect props. Plus 20, it also nerfs a random set. Eh, not really worth it in my eyes, to be honest with you. Come back up here, we'll grab that. Heal back up. Okay. I mean, we are looking pretty good right now. Um, oh, let's make our way down to the bottom. Or, I don't know, something. Oh, I forgot that we can pick up potions to overheal. And it'll potentially give us a chance to get a blue heart. So that's kind of a little bit of a bummer with that. But, I mean, we're still doing pretty okay. Could get more cooldown, which could be insane. Also, damage on this would be crazy. Because that's actually 8 plus 8 damage. From 17 to 25? I can't. I, I gotta go Stormbringer, dude. Like, the cooldown is almost constant. Like, as soon as they go out and disappear, like, they're already going out again. Which is almost perfect. I wonder if we can get it to where they're, we're shooting it out twice. That could be pretty crazy. Okay, let's make our way over to the movement speed. To be honest, the skull's not that good. I, I, I imagine it'd be pretty good if we could get um, more upgrades on it. Like, more projectiles would probably be pretty good, so... Okay. Which I'm not opposed to upgrading. Okay. I'll take a hit. Okay. Guess let's run down here to the crit. I might pick up the cooldown thing here in a second, since we are at half HP and we are up to 15% damage. So, is there a cap on this? It doesn't really say. Are you on effect prob? Attack speed? You know? Let's roll. Yeah, I'll take that. Ooh, okay. Ooh, okay. Um, can't really do anything unless we will go for the fire, which I'm not going to do, because we don't really have any burn damage. I still don't know if it really gives, like, a probability um, of damage, but, yeah, this feels pretty good. This feels pretty good so far. Okay. I mean, I feel like we're... <clears throat> Kind of in a spot where, like, I mean, of course, like, we could still get hit and get smoked. But, like, to be honest, like, we're in a pretty good spot. And we're on expert mode, so, like, we're in a really, really good spot. Like, Stormbringer is definitely the way to go. I feel like Swords could also do it. The, the Hammer, though, the Hammer, not so much. I don't think the Hammer could. I think we would die pretty quick with the Hammer, as seen in previous uh, instances when we... We couldn't even beat hard with the hammer, let alone trying to be expert with the hammer. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. All right, let's see. Um, yeah, I'll go you. Go you. 
forgot we had bounces. Okay. Let's get hit. Okay. That should bump us up to 17? 25, I think? I wouldn't mind trying to get like 20, 25. with it but I mean we could get that my only downfall would be like if we well one we don't have a whole lot of gold and two like if we were to take it and then like it nerfs like movement speed that would suck a lot damage would suck a lot um what else okay oh, we got three now okay Okay. Fill up just a tad. I'm not gonna worry too too much about uh, this since we do have the magnet. Okay. Looking good so far. Maybe we gamble. I mean, we got 38. Oh, I just want to make sure that we have enough gold for when we go to the um the shop. I want to make sure we got enough gold to go to the shop. That's the big thing. Yeah, we got seven points. Is it time? It might be time. Screw it, let's get it. Okay. Oh yeah, dude, look at the speed on that. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. Oh man, dude. I love the cooldown. Holy smokes, man. Okay, this is this is insane. Oh, I guess the only other ner downfall would be if it nerfed cooldown. Because it's one random stat. Ooh, this guy might hit us, so we gotta be careful here. Um, cooldown bounces I'll take. Let's do attack speed. Let's do damage. Okay. okay. We already got him down pretty far. Okay, you gotta be careful here not to get hit. Holy smokes. That was actually crazy. Oh, totally got hit there, so that just busted uh, our one thing. Can't get hit again. He's about to die, which is huge. Okay, and he is done for. Okay, easy peasy, baby. We did it. Alright. Now going into the final stage. In Paralyzing Enemy, there is a 35% chance... Oh, that's kind of... I'm grab this. 35% chance that one lightning bolt strikes other enemies, paralyzing them. Okay, yeah, that's actually huge. I'll grab this too, that'll help. Uh, each enemy has 75% chance of being paralyzed. Holy smokes, man, we got a lot of paralyzing going on here. Um, I'll definitely take all that. What do we have? Do we have anything that could... I mean, projectile speed could be flipping insane. I'd rather try and max out damage first, though. Which we can definitely do. Um, I wouldn't mind trying to do this one as well. This could be crazy. I have a 10% chance of creating another skull. Or we could go... Increase the number of projectiles plus 5. Enemies paralyzed by this relic will explode in 3 more beams when dying. Um... Hmm. Hmm. So we have 5 projectiles right now. Screw it, let's up, let's up it to 10. Let's try this one out. We've done this one before, so we'll, we'll try this out. We got a lot of lightning going on, too. Okay. Lots of lightning going on. Okay, it would be insane if we could get another, um... Another, uh, cooldown, um... <clears throat> Whatchamacallit? 
Okay, what do we got up here? Is it the is it still the same? No, it might still be the same. Okay. Oh, I do want to upgrade the skull. I want to try and get more projectiles on that. Oh, I need to make my way down. Oh, it's still the same. That's a bit of a bummer. It's a bit of a bummer, but what are you going to do? That's okay. I would say we could roll the dice for the boss, but it, it, we're talking about the boss here. Um, plus three damage. That actually bumps it up by seven. Or we go uh, area. Let's go area. More area, the better, baby. Okay. Let's try and grab this over here. We're not one shot in the big boys. Not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. Um. Collect 15,000 experience orbs. Okay, cool. We unlocked a rare fossil. That's pretty sick, dog. Not sure what that does. They grant additional dash. Ooh, this could be huge, actually. Okay. Alright, we're looking good so far. Cooldown seems decent. We are smoking stuff, so not too, too worried about that. Okay. Looking good, looking good, looking good. Okay. We are getting swarmed, and we're killing... We killed stuff super quick there. Holy cow. That was actually crazy. Okay, so I got more gold. Um, I don't think there's really anything else for us. I mean, there is a health pot down there that we could run down and pick up, or we'll just rotate to it here in a second. Um, should pop up here. Okay. Okay, maybe it's not gonna pop up. We got seven points. Got that. Let's throw it into this, and then the projectiles up to two. Attack speed could be good. I mean, attack speed's already pretty low on this, though. The big thing, though, was definitely getting more, um... More, um... Projectiles on it. Um... There is two health pots. I definitely want to go into this with full HP. Because if you guys saw the hell I believe it was the Helga run that we went in to expert mode to fight the boss, and we literally had one and a half hearts, and we got hit once and we died. And it was hella disappointing. Okay. Come on. Make way, make way, make way. There's health pots down there, make way! Okay. So we got full HP. I want to make my way down to the other health pots before I decide to take another hit. Okay. We're doing good so far. Okay. Holy smokes, this is crazy. Oh man, I didn't realize that we were going to fight the boss already. What are we up to? 55% increased damage. You could probably juice the crap out of this as well. Um, this, I don't think, is going to help. Movement speed will probably help a bit. Um, let's roll once. Cooldown area? Sure. Sure. Okay, we're up to 162 mana progression. Not as good as I was hoping, but here we go. Let's fight this boss. See what we got going on. Oh, how many... How many, um... Project... Oh, only two. That's like... I saw a bunch on the screen there. I wasn't sure what the heck was going on. Hopefully we can wipe Ragnar out pretty quick. We'll see, though. Damage isn't looking too bad. Ooh. Okay. We are paralyzing it quite a bit, which is pretty good. That's huge, though. 
Looking good, looking good. We want to kind of be close to him to uh, get our lightning from our um, shoulder pads to go off. Um, this is dangerous. This is what killed us in Helga's run. Okay. Because it seemed like it never stopped. Okay. Looking good. Oh, yeah, we are going to get hit there. Okay, so we can survive like three more hits. Okay. It's getting very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. Okay. He's down to half. He is down to half. Um. Hey! Okay. Oh crap! We got hit again. We only got like two more hits under our belt. I'm really trying not to get hit. Oh god, dude! I really don't want to fail this. High hopes in this. I had high hopes for the Stormbringer, man. Oh my god. Holy crap, dude, we can literally not get hit by anything. No, dude, he teleported! I was looking up, up top here and he freaking teleported, man! Oh my god, dude, I wanted him to be the first one with the freaking win. Man, I thought we freaking had it, too. Dang, man. Gosh dang it. Okay, let's dump a ton of points into... Let's do damage. Okay, that's all we can do is damage. Um... Oh my god, we're literally 1 XP away from getting a next one. Each empty half red heart increases your attack speed by 5%. Increases the area damage percentage by 5% of the area percentage of value. Interesting, okay. Probably go with the attack speed, to be honest. Your sword has a 5% chance of producing bleeding. Ooh, maybe we do another sword run. But... Unfortunately, that's not going to be the next episode. We're probably going to do, um, I don't know, maybe maybe another staff run or something. We'll see. We'll see. But thank you guys all for watching. Unfortunately, we didn't get the win. But if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to tap that subscribe button. Also, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.